And now new tonight, an important scam alert. Some drivers have been getting fake red light tickets in the mail, and they look pretty legit. CBS First Austin Carter joins us now from Tamarack with one person's cautionary tale. Austin. And that bogus ticket said that this man's car was captured on a red light camera out here at Commercial and Pine Island. But here's the thing. There is no red light camera here. This was one major red flag among others to look out for. A scam targeting drivers in South Florida. Yuri Vasquez of Lauder Hill says he received this letter in the mail thinking he was going to have to cough up some cash after being caught on a red light camera. They were asking for $178. But the closer he looked, some things weren't right. Misspellings, an incorrect police logo, and out-of-state addresses. The address to send the payment, uh, it, was, it was in Seattle, Washington. Another PO box. Yuri reporting this to Lauder Hill Police. They are joining other law enforcement agencies in Broward and Miami Dade, warning folks about this scam. It's almost believable, as some of the fake notices have photos of the person's actual license plate, similar to a snapshot from a real red light camera. It's usually the back of the vehicle, the tag, uh, and they'll put it in there. It's black and white photo. It's not, it's not very clear on these particular forms. Lauder Hill Police tell CBS 4 News they are investigating four similar incidents of this scam. Major Mike Santiago says the danger to the public is not only the loss of money, you also have the loss of your identity. So people now uh, content to have your, your ID, your name, uh, your home address, your credit card number. So this thing is, has a domino effect. Okay, so to prevent falling for this scam, you really want to double and triple check everything. That includes the name of the police department or agency issuing that violation, along with the date of the alleged violation. Of course, if anything looks strange, give police a call. Reporting live tonight in Tamarack, I'm Austin Carter, CBS 4 News Tonight.